Hello YouTube and thank you for tuning in to the C Corner. Happy Memorial Day weekend. This is going to be a quick nail tutorial on a cute design that I think you'll really like for this summer season. You know the C Corner is not just about parodies even though I have a parody skit coming in about a week and I have my TV series coming up. It's also a place for you to get DIYs, fashion and beauty tips. You know to show you ladies how to keep it sexy and classy. And if you like the tutorials, hey tell me and I'll do more on my nails and also on my hair that I just cut. Do you like? Hmm. <laughs> you guys stay tuned. I hope you enjoy the tutorial. All right, I've already started one hand, so I'm going to show you how to do this on the other. We're using the Gelish nail polishes. We're going to be using the PH Bond. Top it off, Forever Beauty, a Mint of Spring, and also Brights Have More Fun. And we're going to be using the Sally Henson Black. Start out with using the PH Bond whenever you do the Gelish manicures. It helps the polish to stick. You don't put your hands under the LED light for this process. Now we're going to use the foundation. This is like your base coat and you're going to put your nails under the LED lamp for two minutes after doing this. Next we're going to start out with the Forever Beauty. That's going to be our main color for the nails. I really love this color. It's a nice nude color and I'm going to actually be doing three coats of this. I'm only going to show you all me doing one, but I actually for the final product use three coats of this. After each coat you apply, you're going to put your nails under the LED lamp again for two minutes. Next we're going to start doing the cheetah designs. For the different colors I'm going to use to do my designs, I always get a little palette or something to put my nail polish colors on. To apply the dots for the cheetah prints, I'm using a polka dotted tool that I purchased from Sally's. One end of it is for doing polka dots and the other end is a cute little brush that you can use to do the little black outlines for your cheetah print. We're going to start out doing polka dots with um, the mint of spring color and I'm just kind of doing this along like in a curved formation along my fingernails. The dots don't have to be perfect, kind of shape them uneven and really in any sizes that you want. For the middle finger, I'm going in a circle, doing little dots in a circle. Those are the most defined dots I have on my hand because I'm putting the lips in the middle. Now, what I've decided to do in the future is do the lips first and then do the dots around. That's the way I did it on the opposite hand. For your ring finger, we're going to be doing dots all over those. On the pinky, you're going to want to do just dots, three dots on each side. Now we're going to do the lips. This was really, it's really not that hard to do. Um, first, just act like you're drawing a smiley face. That's the way I kind of learned to do it. And then what's helped me is to kind of do like an M, but like a colored in M. Kind of like the McDonald's looking M. Um, that really is how I do my lips. So I kind of do like a McDonald's looking M and kind of fill it in and then with the smiley face at the bottom, like do a smiley face line at the bottom and fill that in so it's some nice full lips. And the color again that I did the lips in is Bright Tab More Fun. The great thing about this polish is if you make any mistakes, just take your, you know, fingernail polish remover that comes with the kit and just, you know, clean it up. After you put it under the gel lamp, it hardens so the polish is not going to go anywhere. Cute, right? I love lip designs. Now you're going to use the top it off over all of your fingernails and you're going to put that under the LED lamp for three minutes. And to finalize it, you're going to use the nail polish cleanser that comes with the kit and rub it all over your nails and then you're done. Voila! I love this look. It's so fun and it's just perfect for this summer. If you want to see the final looks of both of my hands, check out my Instagram at the C Corner.